Hello, I'm Matteo, the Chief Mobile Opinionist here at Tech Travel Geeks, and this is the Tech Travel Geeks unboxing video for the Unihertz TikTok e smartphone. We'll be following this video up uh, next week with the setup video, and uh, as time goes by, we'll be providing sample video recording videos as well as some other videos where the Unihertz TikTok e will be featured. So, thanks to TikTok. Uh, and more importantly, Unihertz, their, their comp parent company, for reaching out to us and sending us this review device. The packaging is pretty simple, apart from the TikTok e on the back and some details on the back of the phone box, there's really not much there. So what I'm going to do is use my jerry rig everything knife, cut through the packaging and get those lips opened up. And once that's done, we should be able to take the lid off the box. Now, TikTok is a very, uh, very apt name for this device just because of the way it's set up from an industrial design standpoint, and you'll see that in a moment. This is the more affordable version of the Unihertz TikTok smartphone, and as we can see, we have designed by Unihertz on the inside of the device. On the inside of the top card, we have a few details, usual SIM ejector tool, there's also, interestingly, an extra screen protector, always, always very handy. tiktok -y user guide, and I'm, this is the warranty guide. So I'm sure we'll read this all later. Now let's look at the Unihertz tiktok -y smartphone. So this smartphone is a relatively rugged, well-built, chunky phone that features a nice big round screen on the back. So for those of you who are tech enthusiasts, this is essentially a smartwatch display on the back of the smartphone, which will give you notifications, show you the time, uh, allow you to perform certain actions. But we'll go into that in a bit more detail in the setup video. Let's carry on with the unboxing and see what else is in the box. So under this card, we have the charger, and this review device comes with an EU charger. This particular one is a 5 volt 10 amp, so 10 watt charger, or 9 volt at 2 amp, that's 18 watts, or 12 volt at 1.5, which should be another 18 watts. So you have a variety of charging uh, standards there, but the idea is that this provides you with more than just uh, your standard charging, it's relatively fast charging. In terms of charging, it's equivalent to what you get from the Google Pixel 6a, which is quite a popular device at the moment on the Tech Travel Geeks YouTube channel. Now, here we have the charging cable. I'm just going to open it up. So the charging cable to the Unihertz TikTok e is USB-A, as we saw in the charger, to USB Type-C. So pretty much the standard nowadays, and that should carry that 18 watt charge quite comfortably. And there is also a USB Type-C to courage port, or USB Type-C to, in this case, 3.5 millimeter audio jack, because the device itself doesn't support a courage port, or in this case, a, a headphone jack. Now let's have a look at the device itself. It comes in its own case, which is really good to see. So nice TPU case. It's not mocodile, but nice, really nice case to, to go with the phone. And then at the back here, I'll just take the sticker off, put that in the box. So this is the Unihertz TikTok. Now we have what is a sort of more of a matte finish from on the two sides. And then this strap along the inside, which is reminiscent of a watch strap, similar to the ones we've reviewed here on the Tech Travel Geeks YouTube channel, but it is in fact just a textured finish on the back of the device. And you can see that lovely little round screen, which we'll, we'll go into a bit more detail in the setup video and the review. The two cameras on the back flash offset to the left. And then on the side, we have a power button and the volume up and down rocker. And on the left, we have two custom keys, the SIM tray at the top. This looks like an infrared blaster, which is great to see. Microphone hole, 
and at the bottom USB type C for charging microphone hole and speaker grill. So what I'm going to do is just quickly turn this on to give you an idea of what that front LCD display looks like. It's pretty decent. Unihertz powered by Android. And we'll wrap this video up. So as I mentioned earlier, we will be doing a full setup video for the Unihertz TikTok E smartphone. Um, we'll also be following this up with more videos about the device. And as you can see there, we've got that secondary screen just showing off the Unihertz logo. So if you don't already, please do subscribe to the Tech Travel Geeks here on YouTube. We cover consumer electronics, gadgets, accessories, and pretty much anything we think makes the travel experience better. For now, if you have any further questions, please feel free to leave them in the comment section below. We'll do our best to get back to you or address them in a future video. But for now, thanks for watching and goodbye from me.